68-year-old Yo Wenfeng is braving the icy Chinese winter. She's part of a small ethnic minority who live on a river known in China as the Black Dragon, hugging the Russian border. According to legend, they descend from mermaids, but that's not all the He Zhan are known for. For generations, the He Zhan people have passed down an ancient craft, making clothes from fish. You don't discover anything about the fish skin if you're just eating it as food. If you dry it, then you'll see there's a kind of fiber at the back of the skin that looks like the crisscross pattern of a web. So it's the texture that keeps the skin from wear and tear. It was Yo's mother who taught her the ancient technique. She's now one of the few Hejan women left who are keeping this legacy alive. First, she skins the fish, and once it's been dried, she kneads it into a wooden press, softening the skin into a leather. It takes around 50 fish to create a top and trousers suit, and around two months to put it all together. But no one in Yao's family have learned this special skill, and while she's teaching her craft to a handful of local women, this years-old tradition risks vanishing into the history books. My mum tried so hard to bring it from old society to the new society. The skill was preserved even when the Hujan people were almost extinct. How can I not be worried? That's why I'll teach whoever comes to learn. Fish leather has inspired luxury brands like Dior and Prada. But here in deep rural China, it's more ingrained in the Hujan's unique culture, language and song. One that some fear is at risk of dying out.